very efficient night. You know, you shot fall and good. Definitely. I mean, I've been working on it for a while, so. What was it like just tonight? It seemed like they were really showcasing you a lot. Did you guys enjoy the game? Uh, definitely. They, um, the shots just kept coming. Opportunities kept coming down the arc. The coach drew up a couple of plays to give me a couple more open threes. And it just, you know, when you get that feeling, when you're hot, it's always a lot easier to shoot in that ball. Um, what was your reaction when you found out the team was adding a Paul Pierce last night? Oh, I mean, that was definitely a good pickup, you know. Always being, being able to. All the first thing I thought was some of the things he can teach me. Because, you know, his Paul Pierce, he shoots it very well. He's just so crafty. Not the fastest, not the strongest, but he's just so crafty. He gets it done consistently. You had a couple of hanging runners in the lane that kind of looked Pierce like. Did you study his game so? Uh, No, not necessarily. Not really. I just got caught in the air. And it, you know that just jump up there. And I'm a, knowing they allowed to, I'm just up there a little longer than most people so are. I'd still be able to knock it down. When did you find out about Paul? Was it before any of us? No. Probably after, y'all. <laughs> <laughs> I just seen it. It shot through my phone, and that's how I figured out. Your ability to put defenders on your hip and sort of create that spacing and to use pace when getting to the basket, where did you pick that up from? Any particular player or coach that helped you out with that? Uh, I seen my dad do it a lot, but um, it mainly comes just from being normally a bigger two guard, so I have to. They're you know, sometimes they're a little faster, so I have to be able to just use my body and get that shot up. You're doing a little bit against uh, Alexi Shred today, a little bit. You guys are kind of going at it, huh? Yeah, I mean that was fun. He's definitely he was a good player. He came out there and shot the ball well too. So it was just fun. I'm glad we came out with the win. Was it like to see Ryan Saunders on that other bench? I think you kind of changed a little <laughs> couple words with him one time. Definitely, you know, just messing with him. I mean, it's good seeing him out there because, you know, that's what he wanted to do. He wanted to be able to get out there and be a head coach. It just was different, you know, playing against him. Normally, you're cheering for him. We're cheering for each other. This time, you want him to lose. When for you, the chance of playing as many minutes, the team putting the ball in your hands, getting confidence from all of this? Definitely raise your confidence a little, mainly just because knowing the hard work that I put in all last year is paying off. Last question. What's the first thing that you want to, you know, you know, ask Pierce and Paul about to kind of help you with? Come right. I just want to ask him how, how he just draws fouls and he just gets his shot up so well. I don't want to know. He got to teach me a couple of little things. <laughs> I know he knows something that that, that I don't know to do for him to be able to get all those shots up.